Well, let's dig a little bit deeper into the Tunica Roadhouse Casino closures. The Roadhouse employs a total of 377 people. It was the smallest casino with 716 slot machines and table games. In comparison, its sister property, Horseshoe Casino, has nearly 1,100 slot machines and table games. Now, Caesars Entertainment blamed a decline in business for the need to close. And while we don't have a breakdown of revenue by casino, we do have it for the Mississippi River casinos as a whole. So right now, the Tunica area casinos are are on pace for the worst year ever with 492.7 million in gross revenue so far this year. Now to put that into perspective, 10 years ago revenues were more than 1.4 billion in revenue. One bright spot, sports betting has brought nearly 2 million in revenue since betting started this past August. Well, local now in Tennessee, a state representative from Knoxville has authored a bill that would legalize sports betting in the volunteer state. House Representative Rick Staples filed a bill known as the Tennessee Sports Gaming Act. If it is approved by the state, it would still have also to be approved via referendum by individual counties or cities. That bill will be formally filed when the legislature convenes on January 8th.